uh, figured out how I'm going to take power out of here now. It was pretty simple. I'll get it started. Here's the RPM meter up here. Oops, I have it on test. Here's the little hall effect. So anyways, if you remember in the uh, video before I had capacitors uh, coming off all the coils, but that's stupid. I, I just, I rectified everything. I have the ground rectified. All the grounds rectified on the six coil positions, and I have a common positive all the way across. So I'm paralleling all the six coils out into DC, and uh, just to show you what it is without a capacitor. Uh, I'm in 200 volts DC here. Let's see, where's the end of this? Here it is. Okay, I'm going to try to do this quick. Okay, so I'm having about 27 volts right now. DC. Okay. And it's going... Five hundred and four RPM. Five hundred and four RPM. Okay, now what I want to do is fill up this capacitor bank right here. This is twenty six hundred and forty UF. It's pretty big. It's only thirty five volt caps. Here's the uh, voltage for this right here. So I hook this up. And I'm, first I'm going to short it out. Okay, there's nothing in there. Here's the voltage. Okay, ready? Fill it up. Dun, dun, dun. Ready, set, okay. That's how fast it goes up. Now, let's look at the uh, RPMs. 437, 440. Now, I'm going to short this out. You can see how much power is in here. <laughs> okay, now, now watch and see how much it lurches down in the RPMs. 490, 496. Oops. Okay, it's 480... Let's say 492, 3, 4. As soon as it gets to 500, I'll, I'll go now. Okay, ready? It's 900. It's 500 right now. Oh, shoot. I hit the... Uh, I hit the timing thing. So, anyways. Um, while I'm good... I'm going to wait for it to get up to speed. So, what I'm going to do is fill the cap disconnect the cap, unload the cap to the load, fill up the cap, disconnect the cap, and uh, and unload it to the load, like at once a revolution or so. Okay, so it's on 520 right now. Watch. Okay, now watch that, how much it dips. 500 right now. Okay, goes down to 461, 400, 461. Okay. So, that is a 2600 cap. Now I'm going to do another one. This is only a 1400 UF cap. Okay, we'll just listen to it now. Go down. Wait, no, let's do the... Okay, RPMs. 497, 500. I'm going to do it. 
440. So it does have lens law when it fills up. But it's going to be like when it's a working system and outputting uh, the cap discharge like once every revolution it'll probably be around this RPMs. It's dropping, you know, 480, 470. So, uh, so just to say one more time, I'm bringing out all the, uh, all the uh, power rectified, but not into a cap. All coils paralleled, and then I then I hit it into one big cap. And now I'm going to disconnect the cap and then let the cap go into the load while it's disconnected. So that's the plan now. I was worried how to do it before, but it's so simple. Just obvious way. Okay, thank you very much. Thanks for watching.